First at four today, the phone call that ultimately cost John Schnatter his spot at the company he founded has just been released. WDRB's Joel Skipper listened to the hour long recording that includes Schnatter using the N word. Joel? That phone call happened in 2018 and the comments John Schnatter made on that call with an advertising firm got him in hot water. What bothers me is Colonel Sanders called black I'm like, I've never used that word. And they get away with it. It's that statement that eventually led to former Papa John's founder and CEO John Schnatter publicly apologizing and saying his comments were taken out of context. Tuesday, the audio and transcripts of the hour-long conversation with ad and public relations company Laundry Service were released. It was released as part of a lawsuit where Schnatter accused the agency of plotting to ruin his career when it gave him an exercise on answering media questions. One of the questions was about his views of kneeling during NFL games. I think it's just making things more divisive. I, I, I won't say that because I don't want to give you guys a heart attack, but I think the kneeling has made things worse for everybody. Laundry Services CEO Jason Stein can be heard on the call continuing to ask questions and give scenarios about what to say and not to say during interviews. Not long after, Schnatter saying he would never use the N-word, his part of the conversation ends. Executives at the agency can be heard discussing it. I hope you The agency reps repeatedly called him racist while talking about how to get him to say the same thing in real interviews that he did during the practice. I just wanted to go and speak the truth. And I want to write down the bullet points and then let him go. He just has to make sure it's an hour long conversation yeah. so that he says like he said here. Uh, he's going to come out. Schnatter has apologized for the comments and has repeatedly said they were taken out of context. He resigned as the chair and he was ousted from any job at the company. His name was also taken off of Cardinal Stadium not long after and UofL and UK returned his donations. Now, During the court proceedings last year, an attorney for laundry service said Schnatter seeks to rewrite history to portray himself as a victim, making the fantastical claim that his admitted use of the N-word and other hurtful language were actually comments he made denouncing racism. You can listen to the full one-hour conversation at our website at WDRB.com. Joel Skipper, WDRB News.